Hey, pretty girls, it's Pink Tide. Welcome to the Pretty Girls Club. You know, hit the subscribe button if you're not. Hey, girl. Hey, as you can tell from the title of this video, I'm coming to y'all with a pack in order this video. Like, y'all, I promise. Like, I feel like I have not did a, like, a legit, like, 100% pack in order this video in ages, okay? So, we're about to get a thumbnail really quickly. And we are about to pack some orders, like for real, for real. Like when I say I'm about to walk y'all through the entire process of me packing orders, like for real, for real. Me and my friend um, Lolly, aka Lolan and Cole, we've been talking all morning. So um, if I look at my phone, that's because we still probably texting. But like y'all, when I tell y'all that I'm about to just walk around through the entire process, I purposely left six orders on my screen because y'all know me. I Baby, when the orders come through, I be packing them right up because I be thirsty. But I was like, you know what? I need to really sit down and do a real life how to pack orders video, how to ship a Shopify video. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to just record from my phone really quickly. But I'm going to still have y'all watching too. And I'm going to probably just do like a little screen, a screen split because um, I want to kind of get the end up of how to ship with Shopify without kind of showing off too much personal information for the people. So I'm gonna just use my phone right now and I'm going to show y'all how to even get the shipping labels to print, things like that. Cause y'all ask me this all the time in my DMs and all the time on TikTok, how do I get the shipping labels? So I'm gonna try to walk through and explain that part right now. And then once the shipping labels are shipped out, I will come back over here to the main camera and we will get it on and pop in. <laughs> So the first things first is, as you can see, y'all can see all of the orders I have done. Well, all the orders I have to get done. I have currently six orders that I need to package. And then this just shows some information. I got three from yesterday so far. And I think four from, no, three from the yesterday and three from today so far. So then over here, you all will see. So basically, Shopify kind of tells you exactly the status, the payment status. Everybody is paid. Y'all know I don't play that. If it don't say pay, I'm not processing it. But then all of them says unfulfilled, obviously, because I have not unfulfilled them. And then even Shopify even tells you two different things. They tell you how many items each person ordered. So as you can see, this person ordered three items. That person ooh, ordered five items and things like that. And last but not least, they also... Uh oh, they also show the delivery status. So the delivery method. So this person chose standard. Two people chose express. So I'm gonna make sure I um give them their express shipping because they chose express and then around everyone else just chose standard. So before 2022, Shopify only allowed you to print out 20 orders at a time. Now you can print out 50 orders at a time, but as y'all can see, I only got six. So I can just click this button right here. And it's going to select all six. So the next thing you're going to do is just literally press create shipping labels, guys. Um, we're going to press create shipping labels. And then it's going to show you all. I think I'm going to sh it's going to show how much money. Hold on. Let me make sure on their address don't show. Okay, their addresses are not showing. And then over here, um, as far as like the weight. So you can try to choose this button. So for me, because I ship out bracelets, y'all, my stuff, my weight just don't change. Okay, my, my weight is the same. So what I like to do sometimes is I just press the word order and then I go over to weight and then I just like to just make sure I change it to ounces and then I just change it to two ounces and I press apply. So everyone order is going to be two ounces. So everyone order is going to be two ounces as you can see because I, I have bracelets. So obviously if you, if you have stuff that actually weighs different weights, I definitely say put that weight in. Um, but for me in my business because I have bracelets and it don't really weigh that much definitely 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 um, It don't really matter as far as the uh, bangles and bracelets So all right here is the shipping so two people chose Express so I'm gonna try to go and do priority for both of them Priority is just faster and then as you can see I'm only charging a five dollars, but the priority is seven So I'm still paying out of pocket for a certain amount of orders, but that's okay So the next thing you're gonna do after you get all of your legal stuff together and all of the shipping services together All you're gonna do literally is just press at the top review and then you're gonna press buy So as you can see it's gonna cost me $29 to ship out six labels and it's going to actually say shipping date um, because today is Saturday Usually I'm not gonna lie to y'all uh, my customers get their shipping track tracking information immediately um, I don't change this now if 
only time I change this is during Black Friday. I um I change it during Black Friday just because when you for some reason when you send customers tracking information, they feel like they stuff supposed to get their house the same day. So if you wanted to, I can like kind of change the dates. If I wanted to, I could just uh change the date to like Tuesday, July 5th, and then that's when they get their shipping. I don't really change the date for me personally. I don't change the date because I, I ship fast anyway, and I'm about to pack up every order right now. So I just keep everything the same, but you do have the liberty to change it if you want to. And then all you gotta do now is just press buy shipping labels. And literally, you're gonna press buy shipping labels. And as you can see, now all of your customers literally have their tracking numbers. All the customers have their tracking numbers and things like that. Now, as far as the printing options, obviously I have a Dymo printer. If you have a regular printer, all you would do is just change that to the eight by eight by 11, which is regular standard paper. Um, but I have a label printer, so my printer is a four by six. And then all you do now is just press print documents. Um, hopefully they don't show, okay, they do show uh, addresses. So I'm gonna just hold it down right here. And then right now, uh-oh, I got just still showing. So over here, you will just see that my destination is my Dymo, et cetera, et cetera. All this, you will have to set this up. And once you set it up once, you'll be good forever. So I wanna just hold the printer down, hold the camera down, and I'm just gonna literally press print. And now everything is gonna come out of the Dymo just like that. Okay, so now we're back here to the big camera and as you all can hear in the background and kind of see all of all of the shipping all the shipping labels are now printing. I have to just get some you know I me, mean, I have to get some thumbnails. Um oh y'all got a new YouTube video coming out too. Today is July 2nd by the way. So all these are done. All these are done. So then next thing I do, I'm going to kind of position y'all. Hold on. I'm gonna bring y'all closer in a minute. But y'all can't really see my face. That's okay. Y'all can't see my face, but that's fine. We're gonna, I'm gonna, you know, do better in a second. So next thing I do is literally I just basically match up all of the shipping labels to the name. So I just match them all up. So make sure this is the same person, both of these, and I literally just line them up it's no real no real logic or method to this at all um so after that now after that as you can see everything is done and I literally just go through and pack up all the orders. So I'm gonna probably speed the rest of this part of the video up and then I'm gonna probably come back towards the end of the, um, one or two of the orders. So we actually have to walk through the first order, speed it up and then I'll walk through the last two orders. And when I walk through the last orders, I'll bring y'all around closer. So the first person, she ordered the purple, the pink and purple charm bracelet, which is already, a pre-made bracelet that I have. They're like the Pandora styles. She ordered one of those. She ordered a pink charm bracelet and she ordered three silver basic bangles. So what I want to do now is just get out my organza bags. Get out my organza bags. And I still, y'all, y'all been here since 2019, well 2020, cause that's when I started YouTube. Been since 2020. I honestly been kind of using the same packaging since 2020. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. To me, I don't really think it's indifferent because, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I should have been upgrading my packaging by now, but I personally don't feel like, I don't think that my business, like I don't know if my business is really required to have such high quality packaging because it just goes in the garbage anyway. So I just put her two um, charm braces in there and I put the three silver basic bangles in there and then her packing slip. The packing slip has a discount code for next time. It has our email and it has our website and it has our Instagram. So my packing slip to me acts as my um, business card. I don't do business cards anymore. I have not did business cards in over a year at this point. And her order is done. So the next person, 
we got she just ordered one item she ordered a white charm bracelet and just like that and i'm literally going to just drop it in a bubble bag and put it in there So actually, I guess I can talk through the most of them. I ain't got nothing else much going on. I only got six orders. So the next person, I'm going to probably bring y'all close to like the last three. The next person also did the same thing. Ordered a white charm bracelet and that was it. So I'm going to have white charm bracelet. And literally, I just put it in the bag. I'm not, I'm not really a person to add candy, confetti, things like that. I don't know. My girls really tell me that they don't really care for that type of stuff. Only thing they care about is their product and make sure it's making it to them safely. Uh, the next person. Next person ordered bundle number one. is a pre-made bundle that I had put together. If you are watching this video, go check out the website. Kind of see what we got in stock. I know we should have some charm bracelets still in stock. And we have, she also ordered a white charm bracelet. Packing orders is, is very simple. I think the hardest part is figuring out how to print out orders, like you know, from like your website. Again, I've never had anything but Shopify, so only thing I know is Shopify. So, the next person ordered the Tusi necklace. Ooh. Okay, Tusi necklace. I'm gonna probably show y'all. Let me show y'all it. Uh, do I have some more? Yep, I have one more necklace box. Gonna put it in there like that. in the necklace box and y'all really don't like the fact that y'all can't see my whole face but that's okay okay so right down to our last few orders so I'm gonna probably bring y'all around I am going to bring y'all around now okay so want to zoom in on what they got um this person got three charm bracelets so they got the can y'all see that they got the glitter pink the white charm bracelet and the black charm bracelet so we're gonna go over here and the black charm bracelet looks like this i don't know why the camera is not focusing the white charm bracelet is right here and then the glitter pink I'm gonna try to show y'all the glitter pink again outside of the bucket. Uh oh. And I want to literally just put her um, bracelets inside of the plastic bag. Now we're back. And then I'm gonna just grab a mailer. And I'm gonna fold up her packing slip. Y'all doing this with one hand? I, I, I haven't, have I recorded with one hand lately? I really haven't.
and boom there you go her order is done so last order last but not least uh, let me flip her things around first Oh, she ordered something simple. She ordered bundle number. Let's see. Can y'all see that? Bundle number two. Bundle number two is right here. It's already packaged up. And I'm literally just going to drop it in there. Put her packing slip in there. The shipping label on that. Y'all recorded one hand is a struggle, okay? Recorded one hand is a struggle. Um, so that is that. And those are all the orders that we just did. All the orders that we just did. Again, like I say all the time, packing orders to me, I love packing orders. Packing orders is always a quick and fast process for me simply because I've been packing orders for going on three years now our three year anniversary is coming up which is november 8th 2019 that's when we started our business so i'm super excited for november 8th to get here cannot believe it's been three years um yeah y'all we still kicking it we still rocking and rolling um what i'm about to do now is i'm probably going to send out a text message because we only got three orders today so far and y'all know me i need more than three orders for the day so i am definitely 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 trying to get these orders going and meet goals so if you like videos like this don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in my next video